it's you know a life enrichment, enriching their lives. A few sips of tea and coffee and some socializing. A great way to get out and catch up with friends. Today's English Tea is all a part of Grace Haven's Life Enrichment Program, a program helping to support seniors in our community. Grace Haven uh, Life Enrichment incorporates the frail, elderly. We have clients that, you know, we're giving caregiver respite, but it encompasses all of those. It also encompasses all the clients that live at Patricia Gardens. It's for everybody actually in here. Um, it originally started with people which were having problems, dementia problems, and uh, but it's open to anybody here in Patricia Gardens. It can get lonely, that social atmosphere of something to look forward to in that month is that, that upcoming event that is coming and you know a time to, to see people that you don't always get to see, you know, a time to mingle with you know people of their own age group, you know, and catching up. I think without this program most people would be tend to just stay in their apartments and uh, with really nothing much else to do, especially in, in weather like what we have now. A lot of us we don't get out that often but there's always something to come down here, a cup of coffee to have, somebody to talk to, and whatever was on, the, the, you know, for the program. I've been here a little over four years. It is a social gathering, and in the afternoons we have different things on, and I enjoy it coming out and helping there very much. This place is a godsend for us older people. Well, today's agenda includes the monthly English tea. It's not the only activity offered. We've had children come in and everything else. Uh, my own daughter, who is a retired high school teacher, she's come in and given a program and different volunteers that come in and do things. We've had some volunteers come in and give us chair yoga. We have people come in and try to get us to dance. <laughs> and uh, just a wide variety of things. There's a printed calendar every month put out and then we know what's going on. We've gone in out to outings to the library, to the museum, Eggly Sheep Farm. Uh, we've gone to the city dump. We've gone for tours around the city just to see what's changed and what's new and what's happening, to see what the ice road and see all the ice shacks out there. Just a way of bringing what's happening outside in our community available to them. Although the program is specifically geared towards seniors, anyone can get involved through volunteering and bringing forward new ideas. For more information on joining or volunteering, call Patricia Gardens at 223-5278. One of the things that really stuck with me um, was what a, one, a couple of the clients have said is they still want to learn. They're still inquisitive. They, you know, still want to live a life and a rich life of, you know, adding to that, you know, of experiences. And you never know what somebody's experience, life experience has been, but it's very interesting to learn firsthand of different things that, you know, what they find interesting and what they don't. As simple as something as reading the newspaper out loud to them it allows them to participate in our community but they don't want to stop for what, what's in print they want to know more you know and that it's it's so neat to see and to be out will add that more to their life for go on Shaw TV I'm Tommy Johnson